Okay. So, sorry that was super stupid. Alright, here. I'm gonna do that again just so it's up. Okay, audio's working. That's all I care about. Audio, it, it's it's unfair to the game if I'm gonna have uh, Streamlabs not want to play its audio, right? So, like, I obviously want to give a fair assessment of the game as I'm doing this. <sighs> but I am super irritated. Not by the game, but by my other things. Alrighty, so let's check this game out. I'm actually not sure how to say it, by the way. But I know I love it because of Kiro, because Kiro's a dog. Press start or escape to see the controls. I'm going to play with a controller, because I do not trust keyboards for side-scrollers. Okay, move left, move right, jump, kick. I have a fire projectile, awesome. Interact, mid-air kick, mid-air kick up, mid-air dive kick. Oh, nice. Woohoo! Yes, my stupid audio works now. And it literally, I did, it works from the same thing I didn't change it from last time. <laughs> yeah, that sounds about right. Thank you, I really needed some water. Alright, I'm gonna give this game some proper feedback. Okay, it looks like spending those fireballs does drain, like, my mana? Or whatever we're gonna call the blue. Okay. So, let's go. Actually, I can't go anywhere left, right? Boop. Uh, I do know this game's entirely hand-drawn. I Obviously, you get some Hollow Knight vibes from it, which I, ad I adore Hollow Knight, so I'm going to harshly compare it to that game, but I'd harshly compare anything to that game. It's, it's unfair. So small, so innocent. What brought you here, little one? Whatever it is you are seeking is laying here patiently waiting. For thousands of years, this door has been sealed. Break the seal, and the prizes shall be yours. Good luck, little one. I shall delight in watching you slowly fall and perish in agony. Well, ye of little faith. Ah, the I always will keep running to the right. I never open doors right away when it tells me to. I assume I can't open the door now, actually, now thinking about it. Okay, I can't. That one dude's head's blown off. I wonder, I wonder if he's okay. Alright, so that stone, like, heals my mana. I really like the his, like, running and... Jump animation. Kill that thing. It looked, it looked mean. I don't know if I should be going down or up. I feel like I should have went up. Ow. No, maybe not. Okay. An old journal. It has already been a week since we entered this place. The air feels heavy. It's hard to breathe. The creatures within these walls are not like anything we faced before. We have ever faced before. But I will not stop. There is only one thing that matters. Shella, Lola, wait for me. I will be back home with the prize, and we shall have the life we deserve. What's the prize? I want the prize. I want the prize. Alright, I'm going to run this way. I'm going to stay down here. We'll go up the upper route later. Maybe? Oh. Those look... Uh, that's bad. That spikes. Spikes are bad. I can't get up there yet. Oh. Keep your tongue away from me, you little weird monster. Eh. <laughs> I want my kick to have extra reach. I have to get in so close. I'm just, like, scared of everything. I think too far I got 20% of my life. I'll fireball you. No! 
Ooh. He has a little dodge to his attack, too. I want to look down. I, I need every game that has ledges to have a look down option so I can see what being me. But yeah, yeah. It definitely has is Hollow Knight with more it's more colorful. Oh. <laughs> Shit. Okay. Don't run into the spikes there. But yeah. Honestly, like having Hollow Knight vibes is not a bad thing. That is a compliment. <laughs> yeah, spikies are painful. Uh, it looks like my mana does not reset, and my health stayed... got lower. Oh, oh. Just gotta keep moving, keep moving, keep moving. Oh, sometimes dudes give you blue stuff back. I'm just calling it mana because magic and video games in general. I like these torches. Okay. And thus he sworn none would ever lay eyes upon it until the end of times. Yeah, but I can I got super jumps. I'm gonna lay my eyes on it. Yeah. Oh Let's see where down goes. Nope. Dude, it's better reach than me. So this is... this. They're aiming for the game to come out in 2023. So this is... An early game. They, they said on their Kickstarter that it's about 30% done, they think. I think the animations are already pretty clean looking. And the hand-drawn art style. Especially like the, uh, the kind of black and whiteness to their creatures' tongues. Oh, that resets the creatures, though! Bummer. Like, yeah, the animation for that tongue is cool, I think. I wanna... I just wanna kick walls, Castlevania ruined me. shot at me. Oh, these things are neat looking. Ah! <laughs> Alright. Oh, uh, wait. I bet I... Okay, hold on. I gotta get reset. I bet if I pogo on them... I can get across by jumping on their heads. I bet? I think. I think I can. Nope. Keep your tongue away from me. Nope. Nope. Shit. I think these ones just let me kick them in the back. They're like, nah, you're good. Alright, alright. So how do I... Like that. Nope, I go right through it. Damn, I thought I could... No, wait, that time I did it. I wonder if I just missed the first time. Ah, okay. What, what was that? I think I can make it to that one. Alright, alright, alright. I'm being dumb, I want to do this. I think I can make it work. I just gotta time my pogos right. Nope, you leave me alone. 
Oh, practice on that thing. <laughs> okay. Ha! I told you. Ah, damn it. <laughs> so it worked. <laughs> Stupid locked door. Fine. All right, I'll leave you two alive for now. Oh, that's a lot of spikes. Is there any way I can go over there? Uh, I can't tell if it's spikes or not. I don't know. I'm going to assume it's spikes. Cause everything else over here is spikes. I could just jump straight down there, too. Ah, uh, damn it, it's not spikes. I could have made that. Alright, fine. Alright, I definitely missed some spot up at the beginning. Oh, what's that? I want it. I want it. Alright, their fireballs uh, are orange and black little balls of death. You activated a mechanism. mechanism do I dig the music in this quite a bit okay you know what it is I think I went straight through him if I hit the fireball both times I think I tagged the fireball at the same time I hit the guy like he had a uh, like there's a uh, you don't have a collision with the animation or something Go off your heads all day. All day. Oh, that's it's gotten spikier. <laughs> Who builds worlds like this? It's cruel. Whoever's the leader of this land, putting buzz saws on things. Gosh. <laughs> nope. Okay, so I did not need to kill those guys at all. Cool. Hmm. I feel like there's gonna be a way down there. Maybe it's blocked for the demo. Where's that saw? I like Kiro's, or I'm gonna keep calling the main character Kiro, even though it's not the name. I'll show you guys a picture of Kiro. It's on the Kickstarter page. Kiro's a cute pupper. Mm. Damn it! No! I don't trust it. I'm stuck here now? gonna guess I don't fit there, so I'm not gonna... Oh, and falling down would be a terrible idea anyway. Oh. Mysterious voice. You made it this far. Impressive, little one. Yet you are strong enough to overcome... Yet are you strong enough to overcome the dangers ahead? I shall see. Oh, motherfucker! Some bullshit. <laughs> Ow, fucking... The second I did it. The second I did it, I knew I was dead. <laughs> you? Yeah, see? If I catch the fireball... 
I wonder if it's causing... You know what it is? It's causing invincibility frames with me, I think. Yeah, okay, retry. Put me back at the... So when I hit the fireball with the, with the, the down uh, kick, it's causing an invincibility frame, I think, with me, where I keep falling. Alright, I'm gonna kill these guys proper this time. I'm not gonna pogo as much, because that seems to keep backfiring for me. Damn it. Yeah, see, right there. You can see me being invisible for a second. Like, I flickered. Ah, damn it. That was high enough. Oh, shit! When you don't press down at the same time. <gasps> really? Okay. Alright, I might fireball this dude. It did it again! See, okay. Hitting that, uh... It stops your bounce. Like, that's rough. It feels like my invincibility frames actually are a hindrance, not an advantage. Alright, alright, alright. I got you, bitches. Okay, that was just stupid. So many dumb mistakes. I can't even be mad at the game. Like, I really like his kicking animation. Her kicking animation? I don't know, actually. I know nothing about this main character. Yeah. Ow, shit. Damn it. Really? Okay. Okay, I'm dead unless I'm smart, so probably dead. No! Oh my god. I'm just so actively pressing buttons that I screwed that up. Ah, shit! This is all my fault. I can't even be mad. I like to really spam restarting things. I need a, are you sure you want to go to the main menu button? We're going to go super fast here. Oh, hey, thanks. Yeah, I, uh, I mean, I'm going to play it for a little while, so I'll keep, I'll, I'll definitely have more feedback. I'm going to go up this time because I didn't go up last time. Let's see where up goes. Since I died and then hit main menu anyway. Oh, I can't go up there yet. Um, the only other, like, thing, I, uh, I accidentally went to main menu and screwed up everything. So, uh, one of those, are you sure you want to go to the main menu buttons might not be bad. Or maybe that's just me, because I'm not, you know. Great. I am doing everything I did, but I'm doing it fast, just so I can get back to where I was officially. Um, I hadn't commented much on the music, but I really do like it. Do, do, do. 
The art style, I love that it's all hand drawn, I really do. Oh, I'm gonna get some super fancy backward dodge. Eh. Oh shit! <laughs> I didn't see it, it was behind my health bar. <laughs> That's my own fault not paying enough attention just trying to run. Boop! Right there, it's really weird that you just spawn here and it doesn't have you falling. Oh, nope. Well. I'm being really nitpicky, so if I say any feedback that, like... You know, you don't care about, ignore me. But if you just spawn there, it feels like you spawn there. If you, uh... If you fall, it feels like they actually... You actually transition from areas. Again. Oh, I got him in three kicks. Damn it! I fell through him. I didn't bounce. Okay, this is locked door, so I'm gonna leave it. I also know that I can do that. Ooh. Ah! I got the thing! Three will grant you power to cast more, more power to cast spells. I like it. I want it. Ooh, thank you for the health. I like the health animation, too. The little, like, green and blue balls. I think that's cool. Which way did I go? Did I go top or bottom last time? I feel like I went down. I'm gonna go up this time. Or did I go up? Mm. Yeah, wait, I need the mechanism, that's why. Or do I? It's not that locked door from earlier, is it? <laughs> Alright, you know, I didn't check last time and I did the same thing where I went up first, then down. So I'm gonna... Oh, this is gonna be a long jump. I love the cape float. It looks like my warlock. It makes me happy. Ow, you dick. Nope, I missed that. Nah, it's still locked. Oh, I didn't jump far enough. Cool, yeah, spawn me there. Good, good call. Thanks, game. I like, I like the little boots. I like my little boots. That was just shitty timing. Yay, some health. Okay. And then, yeah, there's no way that connects these two. So I've got to go down there at some point. Yeah, those two guys don't do anything yet. They're just there. I like that, uh, like, I blink and that my cape wa uh, wavers a bit while I'm just standing still. Like a good idle animation. All right. Okay, I'm gonna try to kill all these guys without uh, getting everything ruined. So when you touch that platform, I think it triggers the uh, shit.
miss that second kick. No. What's that? Really? <laughs> Damn it. Shit. Okay. Just get out of my way. Very low health now. Okay. Nope. 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 Shit. I am very not patient. You're my problem child. <laughs> okay, now where do I go? Ooh, I barely made that jump. Okay, it's all spikes over here. Oh, I know where I go. There is a, is up here. I mean, I'm like dead anyway, because I'm gonna fuck something up in a second. Why is this one on purple? Is it just the flame? That's cool. I like that. Nope. I'm just gonna leave you guys, because if I get close, I'm gonna fuck up and die. <laughs> I need a. I feel like that's going to get me killed too. Oh, but there's a healing thing. I see it. All right, you have enough time. <gasps> Just touching it. Ah. Pumpkin, what up? Thank you for coming and hanging out. Watch my cool little an kicky animations. Wow. I love your dab emote too. Alright. If I have to. Okay, I don't have to go through that room of death again. That's nice. Now I'm gonna kill these bitches. Oh, I guess I can get right beneath them, can't I? Just gotta wait for them to spit. Ah. See, I told you I'd get accidentally hit. I can't make that far jump, so I gotta run under these, and I can't touch them. Oh. That's a little weird. It should be, boop, a smidge down. Or is that intentional? Oh. Oh. Heh. <laughs> okay. Oh, I can't see where they are. That's... Oh. Okay, so that's a thingy that's... Damn it! Don't tell me what to do. I'm gonna perish all I want, pumpkin. Okay. So... guys Whew. when you're at full health I don't uh, well I is there I wonder if there's gonna be an experience system in the game because I didn't see any reason to not you know what what I say what do you mean I said stuff oh shit <laughs> no, I'll wait <laughs> Okay, so I have to wait. Go, go, go. No, it, I. Uh. 
Yeah, it was down far enough, I swear. Oh, it just keeps firing. Alright. This is gonna be another quick reset. I think I did it. Give me, give me an elevator. Yeah! Sweet, sweet elevator. Uh, so close to being dead. Please tell me there's no more traps like right here. That would be sad. Haha, <laughs> sweet. What did I ask? Oh, no, I was, I was just talking. I will fill the, the void with my voice no matter what. Ah, no, shit. Heat fireball. Oh, perfect timing. Ah, that fucker. Okay. Alright, I'm gonna try to be a little more aggressive now, because I know things are gonna spawn and, and kill me. Ah, shit. Well, I want to point out, I still like the invincibility frame, it just does screw up your momentum. It's a good length, it's not too short. Uh, Zach, yeah, but nobody has donated bits for a long time. Zach donated those bits like a year ago. But he was the last person to get to donate bits, yes. Nope. Also, Pumpkin, you you should appreciate everything in this is hand drawn. Like so all the the my little fireball, which is like a phoenix. It's cool. But, Pumpkin, you also gifted my last sub. You gifted it to Hawks. That was you. I really should go back and heal. Oh, that kind of worked. I mean, it did work. Kind of is the wrong... Alright. I am just very confident I'm going to get a double jump at some point because there's so many jumps I've missed so far because I don't have one. Oh, I'm going to die here. I'm definitely going to overdo a jump. Oh, maybe not. Oh, shit. Shit. <laughs> Sad face. For science, do I just figure out if this is a pit to my death? It is not, which means I can get over there. Okay. Oh. I'm gonna heal though, cause I got my, I got the shit beat out of me in this room up here. Okay, at least the rooms with the uh, a cool a cool game design thing. The rooms with the large quantities of en enemies where you're locked. Once you unlock them, the ads don't respawn in there. Like your general ads still do. But those ads don't. That's nice. That's a nice... That's a nice game design thing. So, alright, alright. We're gonna go way over here and we're gonna fall. Ha! Ha! I found the key! I don't want to backtrack all that way. Oh. I will, though. Alright, we're gonna keep going forward. For now. Pumpkin, thank you for the bits! Pump gets too many, stop it. <laughs> stop it! Pumpkin, thank you. It's too many. You can stop. You can stop anytime now. It's gonna keep giving me alerts too, I know it. <clears throat> I 
And my little follower, um, latest uh, cheer thing at the bottom will update. I promise. I promise it does. Okay. Mm. Oh, this is... I'm gonna die. Oh, <laughs> that was close. Sneaky little asshole arrow. Owl Knight. I beg of you, little one, leave this place. Long ago, I followed the same path as you. How long has it been? Years, decades, and all it led me to was ruin. Though what I sense in you, will your journey be different? If you want to fight me and continue your adventure, you can help Kiro team by supporting their Kickstarter campaign. Wink, wink, Kickstarter. Everyone go support them. And I did totally, I did it, and I will give away a free copy of the game later on, too. I mean, that won't be until it releases, but yeah. Because there's a level where you can buy two copies, so I did that. All right. So, I want to go get that key and then backtrack, so I'm going to play this again really quick. But we're going to bring up their Kickstarter. Okay, so thank you for playing Suona's Curse Demo. We hope you enjoyed exploring this world as much as we did creating it. You can help us make our dreams become a reality by backing us on Kickstarter and spreading the word about the campaign. See you soon, Kiro Team. Alright. So, I will definitely be reporting some feedback. Um, the invincibility frames, especially when uh, hitting fireballs mid down jump, was definitely interact causing a weird interaction where I was falling through guys. That was no no bueno. All right, but here let's bring up. I will. I'll let that play while we're here. Just chilling. Okay, okay. So, you can see I backed because it says it right there. Um... The, uh, the demo's up on Steam now. If you just do... Hi, Bean. There, I'll just post it again. Um, there is their Kickstarter, their demo, and their Twitter, which you can totally go follow. Um, I found these guys. They were posting art on Imgur. That's where I found it. So the demo's up. Uh, I won't go through everything on their Kickstarter, but uh, I just want to go over some of their like levels because I hope they get some support off of this. And we'll go back through and definitely go try to unlock that key and see what else it does. So, yeah, they show some different art. A lot of this is just in the demo, but some of these areas aren't. And I'm really excited to see, like, I really like this uh, autumn level. Here, can I make this? I'm going to switch really quick to this. One sec. Doop, 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 boop, boop. Okay. There, it's a little bigger and better now. Alright, they are going to put it on Steam and GOG, and then a stretch goal for Switch, which I will want it on Switch very badly. Um, multiple languages. So, the story your journey begins in a forest as a silent and nameless protagonist. You discover a cave with a strange message at the entrance. Whatever you're looking for, it's not worth the price. Our protagonist ignores the message and enters the cave. As you advance, you slowly gather pieces of your character's past, unveiling his motivations. It is a he. There we go. Um, and the reason why such a tiny man decided to face such dangers by himself. Further down the entrance, you stumble upon a huge door. A mysterious voice tells you that the thing you're looking for is laying behind that very door. Thus, you're tasked with exploring the cave in order to find a way to open it. But watch out, the place is obstructed by hordes of enemies, obstacles, traps, and bosses who will stop at nothing to keep you from reaching the mysterious prize. 
I will say I really wish the demo had a boss fight, but solely because I just want a boss fight. Oh, let me fix that community box. <gasps> oh, I know why it did that. Oh, I'm gonna have to gonna have to fix that. Sorry, pumpkins all over there on the right. There we go. Boop. Yeah, yeah. I know why I did that. That's annoying. Okay, so we definitely get to see some lore. Uh, the gameplay, I, I mean, I felt like, besides the invincibility frames, which I complained about a bit, um, I feel like the gameplay felt tight. Um, definitely want, like, little small improvements, but with the game being so early, of course I'm going to want some small improvements and ways to make it feel more immersive. I think the art style and the music does a great job of that. Um, it looks better, I think, in person than on stream. Like, So I highly recommend everyone go download it. I was watching a stream earlier, and some of the way the hand-drawn art comes across is just better when, you're, when you see it on your own screen. Um... Yeah, I also like that they went with a kick instead of a, a sword or some type of weapon. I think it just makes it feel like, even though it's it's similar, it still makes it feel really unique. So, gotta go open that. I'm totally gonna go open that. So, here's some of the art of different enemies. And we obviously haven't seen all of them, but uh some of the animations they've shown on their twitter they've shown on uh imgur so oh, recommend going and, and checking that stuff out uh they're aiming for at least four bosses and they're related to the story and lore of the game so i'm excited for more and more bosses as many as you can give me i'm gonna want all the bosses all the metroidvania i want to explore i want to have to backtrack um don't expect a map to guide you through levels. That's fair. Yeah, there's no map or anything like that. Though once it's uh, once I explore more, like I feel like there's at least one hidden passage I missed plus the the key. So we just have to go do that. Oh, I keep clicking everything. So most of the art on their Kickstarter is something you can go see, take a look at on the demo. I was just curious if there's anything that I didn't know. You can listen to some of their music here as well. On the reward tiers for the... Oh. Hey, Lencher, thank you for the resub. I appreciate it. Uh, and Bean told you to tell me to get wrecked. Thanks, Bean. Thanks for all the love and support, Bean. Tell him I said that. <laughs> all right, all right. So they have a, a basic level, of course. Where you can just down, uh, you know, donate it for a buck. Obviously, go check out the demo. See what you think. Um... You can, uh, you know, obviously donate more for a copy of the game. It's 10 pounds. So, it's a, I forgot what that comes out to for us. 12 bucks. So, I did uh, the Mockingbird, the $30 one, because it comes with an extra copy of the game. So, I didn't give it away for free when the game comes out. I'm really excited about that. Uh, I want to do the 60 pound one because you can be a name on a tombstone in a graveyard in the game. And I want that. I want to be on a grave a tombstone that'll be cool uh if you want to get if you got all sorts of money you can actually design some stuff in the game too which i thought was a really cool element for the kickstarter but here's the important part oh i need their discord i did need that i have to join that um the team members right here so adir is the one who uh I, who uh reached out and asked me to stream on their launch day which i totally was into so i I wanted to do that. Um, but Kiro team is how many, how many people, how small is this? Three, six people, six people are making this game and it looks awesome. I really like the, uh, the style to it. I'm excited to see where it goes, but here's Kiro. Here's Kiro right there. Let's want to zoom in on Kiro. Um, Kiro is just an adorable little doggy. It says, hello, my name is Kiro. I'm a beautiful, fluffy, and kind of crazy six-month-old golden retriever pup. Adir adopted me around the same time he built the team to started working on. So, I'm going to say Suno. Suno. Suno's curse? Somebody will have to correct me. 
Um, or, <laughs> since I'm the best dog ever, he named the studio after me. He didn't have a choice, really. Otherwise, I would have eaten all his socks. See, it's very important that we support Kiro because of that. Um, so they have a pretty good breakdown of what they're doing. They're aiming for the game to be out in uh, summer of 2023. Game dev, if you know anything about it, does take a lot of time. So I'm definitely not going to pretend like that's not just going to be a lot. So um, do, 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 I'm going to bring up the other screen. I'm going to stay on this. And see, now Pumpkin is back on the right. It's because it's a... Yeah, I'll fix that later. Okay, I'm going to go get that key, and then I'm going to backtrack. I want to see what that key unlocks. How fast do you think I can make it through this game? If I wanted to speedrun the demo. Zip, 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 zip. Alright, I'm in go fast mode. I want to see if how fast I can get that key and come back. and it looked like I could jump down, so. It was just a risk. Woo! Barely made that. everything to death. Let's get that key. Actually, I will go heal right now. Actually, here, I might get hit intentionally. You're invincible for a while, actually. Longer than I thought. That's like, that's a good few seconds of invincibility. Ow. You know, I never did come down here to see if this is like a secret or something. Shit. Oh, I don't need that crystal. Okay. where it unlocks. Okay, see, I knew it locked something, but, like, I didn't know what. I'll go get the... Gotta go flip the switch. Flip the switcher.
activated. Alright, so I have to backtrack quite a ways with that key. Somehow. Oop. I almost just walked off into the spikes. I mean, I guess I can backtrack all the way, right? Is there any place I couldn't go back? If I wanted? Okay. Straight over there, there's two enemies and a wall I can't do anything with. As far as I can tell. And down here, I'm convinced there's something. But I don't know where. I definitely like that upward kick animation. Oh, I'm gonna have to kill these guys again. All right, I'm gonna die here for a minute. Give me a sec. Hi, Zach. How dare Pumpkin do the thing that she did? Yeah, I'm I'm offended, and she needs to not do that ever again. It's too many, too many things. Too many, too many bits. No, no. Shit. Oh, I didn't get hit at least, okay. Whoop, missed. Kick, kick. big turd. What? No. Ah! What happened? Hey! Elleris! What up, man? You're playing a game? What? Are you actually playing a video game or are you like D&D? Because you never are playing a video game. Okay, that was annoying. Oh, Dead by Daylight. Okay, never mind. You do play one game. I forgot. <laughs> Alright, that jump sucks. Screw that jump. <laughs> That's twice I missed that jump. I bounced my head. I need a double... I need a warlock jump. Yeah, floof. Pathfinder as well. See? Oh, I did down not up. I like the uh the purple light aura of the flame. Oh shit, shit. Killing dudes, like, the fact that you might actually get... You might actually get a, uh, health out of them does make it kind of worth it. Damn it! <laughs> I blame Bobby. Bobby. I'm getting really close to that one. I seem to really like to push my luck. <laughs> Shit! Ah! 
Uh, I feel so bad about all the audio issues that I didn't start properly and had problems. That's always really frustrating. This cave's music, the do 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 do. It's cool to me. Oh, you dick. Alright. Okay, got the key. We're going back. Dangerous than I meant it to be, but okay. I should have went back last time when we were playing. Oh! Okay. I, did, I forgot the ads respawn. Have the key. All right. Ooh. Okay. What is this? You found a feather. All right. That. Okay. Well, I found a feather and a crystal then. I wonder if there's another secret I missed. Is there something else I missed? I didn't attack every single wall Castlevania style. through the rest of the demo real quick just to okay I know where to go A couple of those places where you jump up, up or down out of an area and then you uh, you spawn like right here it feels weird that you just spawn so I don't know the exact best solution for that because you're still sort of tied to have a spawning animation or something for the room. 
but that could be a lot of extra work too for each room to have a different animation, right? So I don't know. That that's beyond my pay grade in game dev. I like the owl in the back. I should have went. Oh! Yeah, I totally just got stuck right there randomly on, like, no geo. <laughs> Okay, so that's a second quick run through. <clears throat> so I really enjoy it overall. Uh, my big complaint was definitely the uh, animation, the uh, um, invincibility frame. It causes a problem when you're uh, when you're attacking, where you sort of go through a guy and you still need them to be collision, especially if you're still attacking. So like I hit a guy with um, dive bombing him, as he fireballed up, fireball hits me because my thing doesn't break the fireball, which that's fine. Um, but then when he hits me, it causes my invincibility frames and I fall through him, which resulted in me landing in spikes a couple times. So that's definitely my biggest gameplay comp complaint. The uh, art style I think is great. I like that it looks like paintbrushes, uh, especially the background environments. The music's incredibly good. Uh, yeah, um, I'm really excited. I hope they do well on the Kickstarter. I mean, I know that a game development is a really long process and they have a pretty lofty goal. Um, to to reach at the same time like you know making a game for under 20 grand does seem crazy cool to do if they can so i'm going to root for them to be able to do that i don't really know how easy or hard that's going to be but i can imagine it's not super easy yeah for okay so this is a song i dig is forgotten souls hmm uh, well, I ran through the demo twice past, and as far as I know, I found all the, the secret items. So yeah, I was just showing off their Kickstarter one more time. Um, but yeah. I don't have any... Yeah. I don't have any... I mean, I, I'm going to run through it. I can run through it again. Try to speedrun it if you'd like. I can do that. But yeah, it was just a, a short demo. I think the demo total was maybe half an hour. And then after knowing how to do it, it's much faster. Hmm. Hey, Mac, what's up? How are you doing? Oh, I got to fix this really quick. Da -da -da. I love the Warlock Sloth. Maybe I'm just going to make it center. Maybe I'm just going to make it center. That way it's always. Yep. I think that's how I'll do it. Dude, I am doing good. I was just playing through this demo. Um, and I just flew through it again. I know where to go. <laughs> it is a cool little 2D game. The Kickstarter went up today for it. And it's an indie game. So I wanted to show it off. Especially the fact that it's uh, just barely in development, too, so. Since Pumpkin's given me some crap, I'm going to run through it one more time. And... Then... Yeah. I mean, I showed off the Kickstarter page. I'd be more than happy to... Explore anything else if anybody has any suggestions. Uh, else I'll probably swap over to like Hades or something just to do something else I don't want to cut a stream so short 
but I definitely already showed this off. Okay, so here, what we're gonna do is I'm actually going to, I'm gonna change the screen up really quick. Let's, actually, you know what? I'm gonna main menu this really fast. All right. How do I wanna do this? Do big live scene, but I'm gonna hide everything except for me. I'll leave my face. But okay, so what we're gonna do here? I'm gonna do a quick run through, uh, just as a solid run through by itself. So okay. Uh, and I still have not looked up how to say this name right, so Sono's Curse. Suno's Curse. Sound. Sono's Curse. I don't know. We'll go with Sano's, Sano's Curse. That sounds cool. Uh, I'll take my time through it so we can actually, like, explore the game. Uh, but this will just be, like, to be a clip. The whole thing. The whole full run through with me not screwing anything up play on controller So these are our heal points. Uh, I wasn't hurt there, but that's what that does. It also does respawn enemies. Uh, just for sake of exploration, I will hit up the spots that I can't figure out how to get up to yet. But since it's a demo, I'm assuming I just can't double jump yet. Promise there's... Every wall is a secret in my eyes. I am very curious what the prize is that I'm everyone's trying to do right so I'm going to keep attacking different walls to see if there's secrets too. I want to just hold A and float and have like my proper warlock jump. Ow. walls. I can't tell if it's the invincibility or it's too long. Alright, so like... Look at me, I was able to run through him twice after he got hit. So... 
The, it could just be the invincibility is too generous. <laughs> I'm sure other people are like, shut up, why are you making it harder? And then... Nerds like me are like, but I want a Pokemon, guys. No secret, okay. You could use it to pretty aggressively jump through guys. Alright, since I know I can cheese it right there. Alright, pretending you didn't know you could fall right there and get the secret. There's a whole way over here on the left to run through spikes and stuff. But you can just fall down right there. Oh, I didn't actually put, kick the wall. Kick the wall time. Alright, add, uh, add at least a couple spots in the game where I kick the wall and I get a turkey. I just need it in my life. <laughs> Every game should have wall turkeys, just like Castlevania. It makes, it makes sense. I really like the kick animation, especially the jumping kick. That spin adds to it a lot. your fireball should be stronger too uh, just because it has a resource to it whereas like kicks don't. Now it is ranged so that could be an argument to be made where it doesn't need to be strong because you could then spam it which that's a concern so Ooh, did I make it? Yeah I could Running right there causes a really jittery animation, running through that hall. Since these lines aren't voiced, I need to know who Mysterious Voice is. Like to me, Owl Knight is just as mysterious. And then That was bad. Oh, you dick. You really are... Such a bad creature. Being mean to me like that. Actually, there's no real reason for me not to, uh, to heal. Uh, honestly, for this one, we've been in production for, like, a little while. It's got good animations, the, uh, platforming works well and everything, like, the collision detection, the only issue I was having was the, uh, invincibility frames everything else seems to hit well in my humble opinion I occasionally screw up by just jumping into a guy like that
I ran too far. The second I did it, I could tell I went too far. You stupid arrow. Stupid, cruel arrow. Alright, I'll try not to uh, eat it as much right here. I need to get you turds for a bit. if I'm right under this and it lands? Nope, just tries to land on my head. <laughs> but yeah, I like that I am a little penguin looking dude. And there's an owl knight, so maybe I am the penguin knight. hits were just stupid. I'm gonna go heal up. Because that was terrible. I really like that heal statue. So, you know, because of the the birds and stuff, the owl and just the bird statues, I get a uh, Ori feel. The gameplay is not like Ori. Gameplay is much closer to Hollow Knight, but like, yeah, a little Ori feel to it. Owl Knight, I look like a penguin, which always makes me think of uh, Prinny. <laughs> Well, that is the end of the demo again. So I've ran through it three times. It's a quick demo. I highly recommend go go check it out for yourself. Um, I'll post that link in chat one more time. Oh, I spelled it wrong. <laughs> I fat fingered that, fat fingered that real bad. But no, I, I really like this. I think it's been really fun. Uh, my my criticism, my critique is the invincibility frames. It's definitely too long, and it causes bad interactions where you can run through a guy, which is problematic if you're falling and he has spikes beneath him. So if you do a downward stab. Um, it's a little jarring, some of the spawns where you transition from area to area, as you clearly have a starting point that it's putting you at, uh, rather than where you actually entered the area, if that makes any sense. The fireball animation for the enemies looks a little kind of like just a orange blob, or yellowish blob. 
So that could be tightened up a bit. I'm not sure if it's maybe it's supposed to not be a fireball. It's supposed to be something else. But then the coloration, I think, is iffy. Uh, my fireball is kind of cool. It looks sort of like a phoenix. I'd like to see that uh, a little more detailed. Bigger wings, maybe, if it is supposed to be a phoenix. Um... I'd like to be able to look down on ledges, but that's just like any game I want to look down on ledges. <laughs> uh, and the same thing looking up for no reason. Just want to be able to if I press up. Just have the camera pan. That's every... I always want that every game. I want to be able to just stand still and look up and get an idea of what I'm looking at. But yeah, anything else? No, it's a six-person team right now, plus a dog. So I support the support all teams that include dogs. It's very important that you have a dog on your team. Uh, Castle, thank you very much. Uh, I I take it you're with the dev team. I really appreciate it. This was really fun. I'm excited for it. I back to you. I'm I'm very excited to uh, you know get more glimpses of the game because I follow the Twitter and I'll go. I think I follow Imdr, but. Yeah, I really enjoyed it. I will officially submit, like, I didn't have any bugs. I had one spot where I glitched in a wall, but, like, it was it, a split second, so, yeah. But, I'll happily leave my feedback, and, I, I yeah, I don't really have any. Yeah, the, in, uh, the invincibility frames were the only thing that were issue. Um... Settings, you should be able to make it uh, min-max, because, like, it, the second I tab off of it, sound goes away like that. Um, which just seems like a weird thing, but it's not in window, or it's, I don't know why it does that. But I've had sound issues all day, so it's fine. But no, I really...